is up guys, it's Jordan here, and oh my god, I'm a Steve. Why is that happening? Okay, uh, but anyway, uh, I have, a, I'm kind of sick right now. I have, like, this, a sore throat. So if you're wondering, and that's why I sound kind of bad, if I do sound kind of bad. But, um, anyway, I am here playing more Minecraft Hardcore. And I am going to be talking about something that is probably a little bit overdue since I am uploading this on January the 5th. But, um... Basically, what I, um, <clears throat> sorry, I'm, I'm have a sore throat right now, so, uh, I'm kind of sick again, um, but, basically, what I am, um, <clears throat> what I am, uh, what I was overdue is, uh, I was gonna talk about YouTube New Year's resolutions. Now, it's pretty obvious, by the way, that I just said it, what it is, but, uh, I'm just gonna let you know if you don't know what it is, or you haven't figured it out. Basically, it's a New Year's resolution that is related to your YouTube channel. Simple. Basically, I could say anything that uh, I want to improve on on my channel later or whatever. Um, so it could be anything related to YouTube. It could be daily uploads or something. You know, that's a good one. That's a, that's a great one, actually. Um, it could be... Um, more collaborative, um, more collaborative efforts for if you um, pretty much only do solo commentaries or whatever. <coughs> Sorry, I'm just kind of, eh, today. Um, <coughs> and I, I just wanted to record a video today because, um, I have a few things to talk about. But, um, yeah, it could be more, um, less, uh, solo efforts and more uh, collaborative ones. Um, it could be pretty much anything that you think that you need to improve on on YouTube. Um, <clears throat> so my YouTube New Year's resolution is more subscriber interaction. And uh, it'll help a lot, a lot more when the Square Addiction comes out for this topic. Because um, I think the Square Addiction, I'll meet a lot of fans on there if you guys come on. And it, uh, I, I think meeting fans would be an awesome experience. Because I'd like to play with you guys. I'd probably record it and upload it. Uh, I might do some fan meetups if you guys... Um, if you guys wanted to on the Square Addiction or something like that. Um, and also, um, I'm not gonna tell you what it is, but I've mentioned this in some videos past and I'm actually really excited about the, oh, God. I'm actually really excited about what I'm about to tell you guys, but basically, um, we, uh, people of the Square Addiction, um, I've been trying to put together uh, a special event and I'm not gonna tell you what the event is yet, um, although you might be able to figure it out if you really wanted to look hard enough, but I'm not going to tell you what the event is, but basically, uh, we pretty much have all the people for it, um, and it's going to be, uh, it's going to be soon, we're going to do it soon, and, um, and then I will probably release a trailer for it, um, and the other people can upload it on their channels if they wanted to, but, um, a lot of people have agreed to do it, uh, I have, I'm just going to name a few people, KBC Calzone, um, who is a basically mostly an intro animator, but he has agreed to do it. Retro Blocks, who is one of his friends. Certified Blocks, who, you know, uh, I've done videos with him in the past. Fan of Wheels, who um, previously just left the Yugo cast, and unfortunately all the videos have been deleted, but he, like, literally, I think he's one of the best, like, small YouTubers I think I've ever seen. And actually, a lot of these people are. Um, so, obviously, uh, I think this was pretty much stated before, but I Virtual GM, Soul Silvers are going to be in it. Just because I call I collaborate with them a lot. Um, so, yeah. Um, and then there's a few more people. Um, <coughs> Kratzy A17, uh, Barka Slaps. Uh, and we haven't, uh, hopefully, this will work. We haven't entirely didn't done every, every single thing ever yet, but uh, it's pretty much going to work probably. And if it does, I'll be super happy because I'm really excited for this. Um, <clears throat> and uh, I'm not going to tell you what it is, obviously. I've said that before. But yeah, it's uh, I'm really excited for it. And I'm going to be glad to uh, do it when it comes out. So yeah, anyway, let's go down here a little bit more into the mine. Uh, also, I'm going to be talking about, um, what is it? What is it? Okay. So uh, I talked about the YouTube New Year's resolution. I'm just going to give you a few ideas. What the heck? What you doing here, girl? No. Um, I'm just gonna give you a, f a few ideas for the YouTube New Year's resolutions. Uh, I g already gave you a few daily uploads for one or something like that, but <clears throat> I'm also gonna tell you that uh, it could be to <clears throat> put more effort into your videos, basically, because, you know, there's some people that barely put any effort into their videos and just, like, 
literally put them into an editor, put an intro in, and then just upload the video or something like that. Uh, and you, you know, if you want to edit more or something or make like montages or something uh, for anything, to be honest, uh, that can be bad. Hello, Spider. What's up? Oh, um, how many strings do I have? Because oh, I think I might be able to make a bow now, but <clears throat> we'll save that for later. Uh, I'm probably gonna make a skeleton trap because it was far very usual. <clears throat> In this, anyway. Um, what else was I? Okay, why face cam is a good idea because a lot of people don't realize how useful face cam can be for a growing your channel and b uh, getting your subscribers to like you more. Seeing your face is kind of a thing where it's just like, I trust someone more if I know who they are. It's just like, if I see someone's face, I know what they look like, and I know perfectly well who they are. It's just like, if there is, <clears throat> if I see like, some person with a Zelda skin in a game, and I'm just saying this because, um, in one of my videos, um, uh, it, it was an earlier one, uh, with 3 plus and high virtual GM basically. Um, there was this person with a Zelda skin, and there was a joke that I love Zelda. And Max was just like, it's probably a 20 year old man. So it's just like, I would trust the person more if I knew that they were not a 20 year old man, because that would be kind of creepy. Um, <clears throat> and I'm not saying that 20 year old men on YouTube are horrible or anything, because let's face it, most of the people on YouTube are 20 year old men or something like that. But, um, <clears throat> oh my god, this, this is horrible. I'm so sorry. I, I sound like I've gone through puberty, but I haven't, you know, I still got the high and my- Oh my god, I can't even do it anymore. Oh my god, I might be going through puberty, guys. I'm gonna wake up tomorrow. Oh, hello skeleton, what's up? Oh god. Ja, 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 ja. Oh, she drops in the house. Um, but, <clears throat> yeah, and it's just, um, it's one of those things where I just trust someone more. more if I know who they are. Um, so that's basically pretty much how it goes. Um, I kinda stick to that. Um, but why, another reason why face cam is a good idea is because it's better than, like, just, uh, gaming footage. I don't know why, but I like you, people with face cam more just because their faces and reactions can be, A, funny sometimes. But it just, it, it's just more exciting because you can see their reactions, you can see how it's going on, you can normally tell what they're thinking. And it's just, it, it increases viewer interaction and... It's just kind of a, it's a great, let's just say it's a great way to um, get subscribers and stuff. Because uh, I see more people subscribe to people with a face cam than without a face cam. So, um, <clears throat> and I'm not saying that you absolutely need a face cam to get a bunch of subs. Etho proves that wrong. Um, even though I really don't watch Etho too much. I'm sorry, that's probably like a war crime in some people's opinions. I don't watch Etho that much. I'm sorry. <clears throat> but yeah. Um, so make sure, uh, and I'm, I'm about to tell an embarrassing story because <sighs> embarrassing stories also is a good way to let your subscribers know who you are more. All right. So about when I was about in fourth grade, basically fourth grade is the year, basically. Well, uh, it's pretty much the place where you, uh, a people will make jokes about puberty. And B, people will love silly bands. I don't know why, but my school, uh, my school grade, when I was in fourth grade, was obsessed with silly bands. I never really understood why, but for some reason they were. Uh, I'm just gonna make some pickaxes and stuff. Um, it's really not. I didn't even know why they like silly bands, cause I I hated silly bands. I don't know why. I just never liked them. But um, anyway, <clears throat> basically what happened is, um. I was, my, uh, my dad was at work and he couldn't come, so me, my mom, and my dad, uh, me, my brother, uh, and my mom went to the work to, uh, surprise him and, like, have dinner with him, uh, so it was a nice surprise for him, and uh, my dad was, like, basically there was this work meeting, and, um, uh, he, w we were eating in this work meeting place, and he, um, <coughs> oh my god, holy crap. My voice is so horrible. Um, he uh, had the in the first meetings. He had this like whiteboardish thing that um, basically 
uh, I could, like, you could write anything on, and you know, it would be cool. So basically, I I saw that writing board, and as a joke to my dad, I wrote Pee Wee sucks, on it. and uh, I didn't know this, but I wrote it with a permanent marker on the whiteboard. And my dad looks at it, and he's just like, "Wait, wait, what did you write it with?" And like, I give him the marker. He shows me the permanent marker thing, and I go, "Oh God, Daddy, I'm so sorry." Um, and that's when uh, I like almost pissed myself because I was really scared. Just think about this, okay? My um, the boss of my dad knows that my dad works late. All right, he comes back and he finds puberty sucks on the board. What do you think? He'll, what do you think he'll blame it on, the boss? Do you think he'll blame it on burglars in the night? No, they didn't take anything. What do you think they'll blame it on? They'll blame it on my dad, and my dad could get fired. And I was just like, oh god, dad, I'm so sorry. So, um, basically we panicked, and my dad did manage to clean it up after 30 minutes of lots of, lot, lots and lots of washing on the whiteboard. <laughs> just say that. Um, so yeah, that was, uh, that was a strange day for me, just because I felt so, oh my god, Jesus, I hate it when zombies have this stuff. Scary. Um, that was a weird day on so many levels, uh, just because of that stuff. It's just, like, I, I, I wrote Puberty Sucks on my dad's whiteboard at his workplace. That's kind of embarrassing. Let's just say that. Um, skeleton spawner. Skeleton spawner. Yes, yes, yes. I love you. I love you. Boop, 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 boop. There we go. Golden apple. Oh. Now I wish I was doing Oh, we got some uh, nice uh, saddle string. Awesome. We can make a bow. And, um... I'm gonna remember where this is because I need to make a skeleton trap now. Uh, I'm probably gonna move my base down here actually because that uh, makes sense. Um, but yeah, that's gonna be very useful because uh, I wanna make a trap. Um, and I'm not really sure that well. Uh, I'm not sure that I can do that, but I hope I can. Um, anyway, let us go to the flow. I'm gonna show you how I roll. I'm just kidding. No, um, but <clears throat> let's go back up and we'll stop there, um, because I just found a spawner, yay, yay, wait, did I just, I just went this way, didn't I? I'm lost, okay. lost in the mines, that's really not a good place to be lost. Um, sorry, um, sorry that I haven't really been consistent with what I'm uploading, I kind of just, whatever I play that day, I just upload it, so, that's pretty much how it goes. Okay, it's somewhere around here. Wait, uh, it's up there. It's, uh, let's carve out a path this way. Yeah, this is it. Okay. Um, but yeah, <clears throat> I will see you guys. Uh, actually, let's move out. Uh, I'm gonna move out and move to that skeleton spawner because that's probably a better place to stay right now, just for this time being. Okay, trying to trying to move out, but I'm kind of okay. Lots of fences. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're gonna leave the chest here and we can put all our stuff that we don't need right now. Um, <coughs> I'm, I'm just trying to focus on this right now, guys, so that's why I'm not really 
Rhymes with bow, but that's not what I wanted. Um, yeah, um, also, um, just so you guys know, um, I am not going to be doing a 2013 recap, by the way. Um, because I feel like you guys should go back and watch all of that. That's pretty selfish of me, I think. Just kind of, but I, I just don't. I don't, I, re I really don't want to do that. I'm really busy working on the other thing because I really want to get that organized. And I know that uh, my friends, uh, Soul and Max, have already made one, but I just don't feel like going back. Um, I feel like it's a waste of time. And to be honest, I might do one for 2014, but I'm just not gonna do it right now. So, sorry about that, I'm just kind of being lazy. But, I just, to be honest, I just I don't wanna, I just don't wanna, uh, have to waste all that time to put it together because those are uh, soul knows this because he told me those are a pain in the ass to make though they're just like you have to go back and basically what happens is i delete all of the videos that i have because i want to save space so basically i have to go back re-record all of the things that i've uploaded on my youtube and that's a, like that's a pain to do wait how did i get that redstone oh i got it from just um <clears throat> But, yeah, I just don't, I just really don't feel like doing that. Wait, uh, what's crafting with this? I actually look kind of like this. Uh, how do you make a bow again? Isn't it like this? Oh, I think I did it the wrong way. I can't even remember. Oh, there it is. Okay. There we go. Made a bow. Cool. Uh, I don't have any arrows. I don't want arrows. Let's make our beautiful bow shine. Um, <clears throat> let's just put that back in. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video because I am going to off this video right now. Let's actually put some more. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Please leave a like if you did. Subscribe to Become a Gamer today. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Uh, so see you guys later. And we got it. Uh, in this episode, we talked about some things. Uh, we found a monster spawner. Oh god, Steve. I think it's an optifying glitch or just a normal micro. But I'll see you guys later and uh bye. See you guys later. Again. Yeah, seriously, bye. <laughs>